Just hear those sleigh bells jingling, ring, ring, tingling, too. Come on, it's lovely weather for a sleigh ride together with you. Outside the snow is falling and friends are calling, yoo-hoo! Come on, it's lovely weather for a sleigh ride together with you. Our cheeks are nice and rosy and comfy cozy are we. We're snuggled up together like the birds of a feather should be. Let's take the road before us and sing a chorus or two. Come on, it's lovely weather for us, we ride together with you. Our cheeks are nice and rosy and comfy, cozy are we. We're snuggled up together like birds of a feather would be. Well, there we have it. It's uh, snowing outside, it's about minus eight, and a beautiful day for a sleigh ride. Also a nice day for some comfort food. So today we're going to make a breakfast frittata. And you're probably wondering why there's nothing on the counter except for a place now. Well, that's because I mucked up and I filmed the first part of my video today and forgot to push the record button. So in about half a second, all this is going to change and we're going to pick up with me making the frittata. And what I have done up to that point the only things I've done up to that point is buttered a pie plate, preheated my oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit, and cracked six eggs into the bowl. So let's pick it up from there. So we've got our six eggs in the bowl and we're whisking them up. There's that little red dot. And we're going to add three quarters of a cup of milk to that. And we want to whip that in there too. And then comes the easy part. We're going to add a quarter cup of diced onion. Now, again, if you don't like onion, you can leave that out. I'm using white onion. You could use red onion. You could use yellow onion. You could use spring onions, shallots, leeks. Just something to give it a little extra flavor. I'm going to put in a half cup of crumbled bacon. Again, Add more bacon, less bacon, no bacon, some other kind of meat if you prefer something different. And then I've got probably, oh, I don't know, three quarters of a cup or maybe a cup of shredded cheddar cheese. Now you could use different kind of cheese here too. You can change this up all kinds of ways. Uh, use Swiss cheese, Monterey Jack, uh, I don't know, you name it, you could use it. Parmesan. You could use a couple of different kinds of cheese. You could add some Parmesan to this. So anyway, we're just going to whisk that all together. And we're going to add some pepper. How much pepper? That's the taste. If you like a good bite, then give it a lot of pepper. If you don't like too much of a bite, okay. Now I'm going to add probably, oh, about a half teaspoon of salt. You notice how carefully I measured that out. And we're going to whisk that into there really well. Get that all blended together. Now the two things I did ahead of time, one was I took a pie plate and buttered it. So it's nice and got butter all over it. And the other thing I did was preheat my oven to 350 degrees. So this is ready now. And all we have to do is pour it into our pie plate. If you're not as fussy as me, you don't need to, you don't need to use a spatula out the bowl. You can just go with what comes out. But you know me, I like every last good, delicious straw. There we have it. And it's ready to go into the oven. So it's just that easy, folks. That's a nice, quick meal put together. We'll just slide that in the oven. And so we'll be back in 25 minutes to take a look and see how it turns out. Alrighty, we'll take a nap. I'll wake you up. 
Giddy up, giddy up, giddy up, let's go, let's look at the show. We're riding along in the wonderland of snow. Giddy up, giddy up, giddy up, it's grand, just holding your hand. There's a song in our hearts, ride along, let's sing to a wintry wonderland. Our cheeks are nice and rosy and comfy, cozy are we. We're snuggled up together like birds of a feather should be. Well, our frittata is almost ready to come out of the oven, so comfy cozy indeed we will be. We've got a few seconds left, and uh, I think I heard from Cousin Ralph, and he's going to be here sometime next week to share another story with us, so you don't want to miss out on that. You know, Ralph's uh, little tales of, of life in the mountains is a mountain mole are uh, unique, let's put it that way. <laughs> All right, there's our signal. Our frittata is ready. Oh yeah, look at that cheesy, eggy goodness. I'm just gonna bring the camera over here and let you have a look at it from the top. And uh, I'll, maybe I'll just put up a photograph of it. But until Friday, when we have our shout-outs, story, and groaner of the week, you take care, stay safe, and God bless.